back to Let's Play X-Men Legends Rise of Apocalypse. Oh, thank heavens you're here. I'm the pilot of this dirigible, and I've loaded it with escaped prisoners from Genosha. The only problem is I can't get it free from the moorings. Finish prepping the ship, we'll clear the moorings for you. Thanks. Uh, one more thing. Once you're done here, there are many more prisoners still in their cells. Could you free them? Sure, we can do that. No problem. First things first, we're gonna smash these moorings. We're gonna need someone with a lot of might to make it easier for us to do that. That's where Big Jill comes in. Yeah. One down, seven to go. You can see all the red X's on here is where they are. That's what needs to deal with. A lot of these really big boxes. Thankfully, they only look sturdy. You can get a couple of enemy, uh, enemies' items from them, rather. Sometimes it can be tough to target for some reason. Like, it sees you hitting them, but it doesn't register the damage. It's happened to me once before, so... Just make sure, if you don't think... You, to make sure you're hitting them, you see, like, a little bar where they should be, and you should be right on top of them like that. More on this side, and then we come around the other end, and that should be it. See, I'm not even making. Damn it! Wasn't even making sound that time to hit the thing. All right, come on. Do you want to go on this side? Wait! Yeah, decided Juggernaut's punch is not a Wolverine. Wolverine's got the boo. Yeah, decided Juggernaut should have the hoo yeah. I can, cause I kind of think of TJ Combo for some reason when I do that. He was striking me someone again. That does it. The ship is free to leave. We'll be taking off as soon as I get the engines warmed up. Good luck to you. All right. While you do that, we'll be taking care of the prisoners. Can I get my camera to? Angle, thank you. Jesus. I had to go through enough bullshit today. I record re-record my audio again, because for some reason my microphone like had like a bunch of white noise on it, so. As you wish. It's okay now, hopefully it holds together for this recording this time. I mean never even had that happen to me before, so I don't even know what that was. Might have been just a freak accident or something. <sighs> Try to get to this as quickly as possible. That petty of a tyrant. You do know he's trying to blow up the Genosian Seawall just because we kind of stopped his plan. So he's literally taking his ball and going home like a big blue puss bag. I assume he's blue because everything I see him in, he's all blue and shit. Mind me, we run into this apocalypse, pull down his pants, and spank his ass with a hoo yeah! Trying to avoid the doors because I know one of these corners has something for us. That only a brotherhood can get him access to, which is why I figured it'd be the easiest shit to bring the whole team down here just to get more experience and just beat on these dudes. Actually, now that I've broken all the dirigibles, I don't really need Juggernaut all that much. I could use Toad instead, just because his shit comes out quicker. Gotta get over here, because I see a, uh... I do need Juggernaut for these doors. Oh, wait, there's a... I was gonna say wall, but we can go through the door here. Get that down! Come here, you! God damn it! Oh, my little bitches! Put your pants down, spank him too. Those, those things actually had pants. Burn them. Very well. Okay. 
Okay, here we go. Taxation energy. Should be one more item down here as well we're looking for. So like I said, we need a brotherhood to get to it. That's the exit. We don't want to go that way just yet. Gotta make sure to comb all these areas because you'll find out, especially in these couple of areas, that it pays to be thorough. Oh, I don't want to go that way just yet. We still got to find the other thing. Let's take care of that first. Again, it's in like a corner somewhere. I've easily glossed over it a couple times in test recordings. It should look like a console or a switch of some kind. Get that thing out really quickly because it drains our EP. more breakable shit. Get that if you want. Again, not what we're looking for. Affirmative. <sighs> Making you can fly over there quicker than anybody. Can't pick this. Okay, we haven't checked this corner yet. It should be over here. Get that down for the irradiation gets us and does damage. Yeah, here we go. That door opens. Use that door to get this open. Another homing beacon. Yay. Now that we have all four, the secret portal back at our home base will unlock. We'll be taking care of that real quickly. With that done, I can head over to the place we glossed over before. You might have seen it earlier, just a little bit of water. Make sure they deal with these enemies first. Affirmative. I need Magneto again, just can fly there the quickest. Huh. Better the wrong way to go here. Try this way. There's actually multiple ways to get into that area that connect. And this is one of them. Hey, it's our old friend Blob! Hey buddy, how about a hand here? What's up, man? I was trying to escape from prison when this bomb went off. I didn't have much choice. It was either hold this wall together or drown. So here I am. Hey, what are you laughing about? Just nice to see you finally found a good use for your weight problem. I don't have a weight problem. I'm just big boned. Mm -hmm. But we ain't got time for chatting. You gotta defuse the other bombs before they go off. You can do that. You have more than like should have got out of my way. Take these guys out on the upper floor. You can see the X's over there, the two explosives we need to take out. Now I've tried my damnedest to try and jump over there with some guys and use their strength to get through it quickly, but it never seems to be the case. Thankfully I got a flyer to make it over there easy. Just use Magneto to punch the shit out of him. Oh yeah. 2014. Master Magnet has to resort to punching shit to get things done. Shouldn't be able to just like... Magnet it. Oh, I don't know how that would work. I assume we're just gonna destroy the consoles or whatever. Again, he can just use his magnet to do something about that, I would think, but uh, you know. What do I know? I don't need to get caught up in invisible bullshit on the floor. I kind of thought you'd cut out on me and leave me with those bombs. Thanks for defusing them. Now, could you do something about this wall I'm holding up? Yeah, we can do that. Sure, whatever. Let's, let's check on everybody while we're here. Affirmative. There's two ways to do that. The first is this little console here, which, which if we activate it'll tell us it's not complete. It's missing a component. Which will show up as a red X on the map. We get that. But because we have someone with might, we can just do this. And done. Thanks for saving me. But what are we doing working with the X-Men? Long story. 
Well, we ain't gonna have much time to talk right now, cause we got company. Deal with company. Sit your ass down. Okay. Now that we've done all that, we just nice damage. Get down here. More of them. I could use more of them. Yes, stand up and fight. Okay. Affirmative. Grab them. If you insist. They can just fly out. <laughs> I found a target. Leave on the other side will take us right to the exit. Yep. So I'm gonna lead Blob over here. to take care of. I trust you are not the best at what you do. <laughs> it's good to see you guys. But what took you so long? Wasn't exactly easy to just walk into the place. Yeah, yeah. I feel real bad for you. So what's next? Blank will teleport you to the sanctuary, and then Xavier will fill you in. Oh, Xavier, he creeps me out. Feels like he's always reading my mind. Only if you give him a reason to. Blank, do your thing. Sure thing. Here we go. Blob. Do with this motherfucker who tried to straggle on us. Couple of hidden doors, but again, we have found all the hidden items. We have to uh, take care of that uh, little portal back at the main base. We'll do that now before we head on to the next area. Bring up the pause menu, hit up blink portal. Make sure you're not uh, make sure you're not too close to the door because sometimes you can hit that by mistake because they're both done in with the square button. And now we're back home, and we can use this to go straight back to where we were. Close off. This is where we need to go to our little bonus area that opened up now that we got all the homing beacons. Okay. Thankfully I won't get too lost down here. The only problem is these enemies are really, really tough. So if you're actually playing on a harder difficulty, it might be in your best interest to wait on these and come back. Since you're a little stronger. But, you know, done well in my test recording. I feel strong enough to take these guys on. Just make sure to hit those consoles all the way at the end of these little corridors here. Wait for my energy to go back up and just deal with these guys, because these guys are the more annoying ones. Just because their health is really high and they have a stun thing they like to knock you down with. Just empty the barrel with your powers on these little bastards. Okay, that's one. Get out of my way so I can take care of the other one. Hit the console. Always make sure to... Yeah, the green arrow will go away to make sure you, to let you know that, okay, you hit this one. Just in case you miss one by mistake or think you have hit it. Get this guy in the corner. It's time to heal as well. Here, you take one. Then after we get all three, this big guy will come out. Sometimes he's, he'll say he's vulnerable to the pop-up. Combo. Forget which one that is. But once that's done, we take him out. All three consoles are down. We get to pick up Iron Man's Gauntlets. Yes! Tony freaking Stark is one of the three secret characters in this game. That's where the all the beacons come in. He'll join in very, very late in the game, like near the end, but once we're able to get him, he will be worth it. Made it to the living quarters in the southern habitats. Well done. Apocalypse has apparently turned it into a makeshift prison. If you do continue on, try to free as many Genotians from their prisoners as you can. Will do. Sure thing. Even Wolverine does. Welcome, Wolverine. It has been quite some time since we last crossed paths. Well, if it ain't Yuriko Oyama, aka Lady Deathstrike. How you doing, Toots? I am quite well, and I see you are still an arrogant brute. Hey, I'm just playing to my strength, sweetheart. So, you still have to kill me? 
Or did you see a shrink and get that rat's nest of a mine straightened out? Oh, I still hold you accountable for the theft of my father's work with adamantium. Doll, I've been trying to tell you for years. I didn't ask to have my bones covered in adamantium. It was forced on me. You are a liar, as well as a thief. And I will have your skeleton as a trophy. Enough of the sweet talk. You're working for the Jokers who took over Genosha, aren't you? Correct. And when I discovered I would be facing you, Wolverine, I offered to work for free. Shall we begin? <sighs> nice claws. Almost as nice as mine. But let's see if you really know how to use them. I have trained for years in order to defeat you in battle, Wolverine. I assure you, I will not fail. Bring it on, bitch! Alright, Lady Deathstrike. She has that little spin kick of hers that knocks you down. She moves really quickly, too. There's a lot, give you a lot of stuff to work with as far as uh, health and energy packs. Oh, damn. How'd she hit me from a bear? After you beat on her for a while, she'll head for the second floor up here and go to one of these to try and regen herself. She'll get a little bit of health back. Just beat on her until she comes back down and then just continue the fight. Lather, rinse, repeat. This fight will take a while. I will say, um, you can avoid this fight completely if you come at her with an active Brotherhood character. Like if you select the Brotherhood character and talk to her. And if you pay, uh, 2,000 tech bits... You can bribe her to get her to leave you on, just skipping the boss fight. But where's the fun in that? Besides, I need my tech bits for things. Probably need them to buy more uh, health and energy packs once I'm done with this fight. This girl's a pain in the ass. Hang on. Should be going at her with. This is his attack. I'll know I'll be hitting her. I do not have sure enough thing. power for that. Damn it, don't use that attack. That attack is shitty. Ugh, hit the AI for Sunfire can use the sh shitty attack. I want the one that hits no matter what. It's probably how you should approach this fight. Just empty the barrel with like ranged attacks so she doesn't get to you. But the problem is she's like really fast. Plus I got a flyer, so I'm gonna hit her off as quickly as I can. Just one or two more hits to go. Well, more than one or two more. One or... I require additional energy to do that. I require Could uh, switch out for Gambit for a uh, storm. Form a team called the New X Men, which would give me more energy for this fight. But uh, Gambit for uh, another. I do not have enough power for that. I Gambit to talk to somebody else over here as I reach him. One more ought to do it. Sure. Here yet, you guys. As you wish. Yeah, lay them combos. Yeah. Let me get some more of that. I require additional energy to do that. God damn it. You have not seen the, the fuck down. Talk to Saber Tooth and just get back to the sanctuary. Maybe he knows why Lady Deathstrike has claws like Wolverine. Take a lot of beat on these things, you can get a. As you can see all over the place, there's these breakable stuff. You can get some health packs and energy packs, which you're probably gonna need after that fight. Ugh. I'm starting to actually be a little generous here, giving them a couple to me. Now, it doesn't matter which way you go, either left or right, but this way's the exit. We'll have to hit that up later, but we're gonna need somebody to unlock it first, so. Let's deal with the left and right and see if we can rescue some prisoners like we. Told Xavier we would. Moral obligations! Right. And, uh. I'll bring out Gambit for this just because he hits the hardest. Of course, everybody's over here now. My guys are in trouble. Stop using the shitting fire effect. Even have your AI set to use the better one, but you keep defaulting to it. Yeah, I don't get that at all. Hmm, I was hoping to take this place a second and then the other place first, but it don't matter. 
Because I think this way is actually the guy that helps us unlock the exit. So we'll hit up the first place first, but let's, uh... Well, we're here now. Get plenty more stuff to break. Yes. We'll do. What's everybody's doing? Sure thing. Don't want to take too much time. Sure thing. About time you people got here. Apocalypse is ruining Genosha. You have to stop him. And you are... Name's Caleb Ban. I'm the director of this hydroponics department. Why aren't you in prison like everyone else from Genosha? I'm being forced to keep up food production. Otherwise, they'll let everyone starve in their cells. Well, we're gonna put a stop to that. That's good news. Here, let me open this door for you. It'll get you into the next area. Thanks. Blink, teleport Mr. Ban to the safety of the sanctuary if you please. You got it. Mr. Ban, get ready. Cause here you go. And then that door opens up. Which doesn't show up on the map, so you gotta kinda comb the area a little carefully. It's actually right here. Yeah, you can see the little pointer there, but there's no showing up on the map. Normally this would be a homing beacon, but because we got four already, it becomes bonus experience points instead. Once again, driving home, that it appears to be thorough. We'll just come out on the other side of here. As you can see, these exclamation points are for more prisoners. Oh, hang on. Smashy, smashy. Let's hit this one. Oh, this one's locked. Just smashy, smash what Wolverine in the hell? That sword attack is really good. If only you can get all three hits, it's very rare I get that off, but still. Potential's there. Lay on this guy in the corner, grab these prisoners, and let's go. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I was trapped in there for days. Any idea why Apocalypse is holding everyone prisoner? Not really, but he's been running a lot of tests on us. Like medical experiments? Kind of. Apocalypse has been testing us for harmonic DNA. And that is... I don't know, but Apocalypse was furious that he wasn't finding any. Alright, thanks for the info. Blink, do your thing. If you do your thing a whole bunch of times, actually, for these guys, let's... I'm getting up! Just give me a bit. You got Sorry. it. You came just in time. Yep, no problem. Again, you want to comb in these areas. We found the one thing that was hidden down here on the one side. There should be something else hidden on the you know, other side. Then after we clear all this out... Ooh, that's gonna leave a mark. We'll do right now. This area's just a little more expansive. I'm gonna get a little lost down here just because they throw the exit at you first, and I thought it was on the left or right or whatever, but now it's just that guy unlocks the exit we talked to, that Caliban character. Well, these guys are mental resistant, but I'm not rolling with anybody mental, so it's okay. My power is kinetic. And again, it's weird. Wolverine will do the most damage to property because of his uh, might effect. As far as overall damage goes, the gamut could just like one combo the shit out of everything. Just because that's my, what I built him up to be. Stop running away. Ugh. Fucking pussy ass bitches. At least these will stay on you. Now I can defeat any evil on earth. Getting a lot of levels here. Yes. Only way to get past this force field is to find the control panel that shuts it down, which is on the other side, so... Damn it. Try not to get too close. There we go. Otherwise you get that text box to show up again. Yeah, you can just have Nightcrawler as long as you got one point in teleport. You should be able to do that off a uh, double jump. Just hit jump and in the air again, I'll just do it. That way you don't need to, like, set it for anything. It'll, he'll just... Do it that way. Gives you a. So it actually gives him an extra power to buy. Again, really good if I can get all three hits off, but it's very rare that that happens. If you say so. Right. So my gambit's combo is easier. Oh, hang on. This top-down perspective is not helping me. Fine shit. Forcing this thing on me. Smash all these things. 
There should be stairs leading down here, but somewhere, but yeah, fuck it, let's jump down. Oh, about to, to heal myself, but I didn't need to, because the level up took care of that for me. Also, tearing off those consoles. Please, these two. It's damage, but... It's only... Enhanced damage is only a threat if it actually gets the chance to use said damage, so... Alright, we got that. That's all for that side. Let's head this way now. Get ready to get lost down here. Victory is mine. I require additional energy to do that. Huh. Get through them with night crawlers. As you wish. He'll try to teleport there, but he won't go through completely. This door, on the other hand, you can. Couldn't open that before. You can't really see it just because of the top-down perspective, but that'll open up for it, but well that door won't open up, but these will. Actually, hang on, can I push the button and open that? No, I cannot. So yeah, it's actually in your best interest to take Nightcrawler along with you. Doesn't really give a whole lot to save the prisoners, except for like Again, more, more moral responsibility, more or less. Plus, you're going to get 2,000 bonus experience for doing it. So, there is that, too. So. I think it's this. Nope. I know it's a... I know it's one of the rooms. Oh, oh, I'm free. I know it's near the prisoners that there's the other item on this side, and it's a comic book. Again, not very... Unlike in Legends oh, 1, they're okay. not mandatory to grab, but still. I make sure I, I just want to make sure I get everything and can show that off as best I can. As you Switch wish. my flyer just because you can get over there quicker. Right. So the gamut because yes. he's my big damage guy. Well, just have the Nightcrawler teleport us Don't in to where we need to go. Yeah, I'm just going through this quickly just because my recording's scrapped and I'm just trying to make sure I get to this. Okay. I think it's this over here that houses the... Wait, no, that's just what you call it. Which means it's got to be this one. There we are. Yeah, I knew it was by the prisoners, but not in actual prisoner cell itself. Which actually might have been made for a good hiding place for these, but no. Where are you going? I should just beat more dudes down to get to the console. Somebody help me. What's in here? Just more breakables? Yeah. yeah. Out of the way, guys. Try to fix the top-down perspective. There we go. And use the right stick, kind of. Oh, I can't tell you how glad I am to see you. Yeah, it's it's this room in it's these rooms in particular for some you reason. Came just in time, thank you. Put you in a top-down perspective, but you can fix them a little bit. This should be the last you one. Can... There we go. There's our bonus experience. Okay, that's everything for this area. Next time, I'll have made my way where the uh, extraction point was. The door, the door right in front of that to the northern plaza where I will see you next time on Let's Play X-Men Legend.